Right, here we go. Let's go to Ithaca. The f other skyway of pirate that you... Not pirate, of Aquila that you never ever go to. Right, here we go. Let's hop off. I was like, kind of confused what was happening there. But hey, we got it. We got there in the end. Let's go. This is Ithaca. Welcome. Um, really, really short-lived area. So cool, though. So cool. So, so cool. We'll go out on the Skyway show. But those of you who haven't seen Ithaca, it's great. So cool. I actually love Ithaca. It's such a nice place. It's so tranquil. Like, it's just in the middle of nowhere after a crazy Scylla fight. Um, Strangers. Now, who are you? I am That's myself. Should have made it here by I now. am myself. What do you want, dude, with bread? You have the look of a hero in your eyes. Humble cave. Will you help my okay. We will go to the Humble Cave and find out that he has been bad boy. We're actually going to be level 65 really soon, which is the old max level. Basically, the max level, because there's only five more levels until we actually max. Which is sad. Very, very sad. But at least they at least they didn't end it on like an, a weird number. At least it's a full, like a proper number. Not like 65. Ithaca Skyway... Um, only Skyway that has an entire palace taking up all the space. Exactly. Yola says hi. Truly am I Level 65. Yay. GG. Amazing. Let's um, quickly level up our main companions home. real fast. Just because that's what I always do. We will level up the others when we're at max level. Um, Ithacan Sonjura. That's cool. It was 65 for three years, though. It sure was. It sure was. Um, luckily, it's not anymore, and we still have more to do. And I can still earn XP. I'm actually interested to see how early I managed to get um, level 70, because on my Musketeer, I had to do side quests to get to level 70 after I finished the game. Um, where are we going? The Lyceum. Ah. Do I have a mark? We do. Let's head over there then. Update for Pirate. That should be their New Year's resolution. Definitely should be. Um, Valiant Glory. Boom ba dum boom. Boom ba dum boom. Um. Yeah, I'll be actually very interested to see because this is the first time that I've actually had um, a character that hasn't been blocked at level um, 65. So, because I, I believe I wasn't on my, I believe I was blocked at level, finished at level 65 on my Musketeer. I could be wrong though. Um, but yeah. Any, if anything, I'm at least hoping for a, a magic mirror. That would be cool. I doubt it, but that would be cool. When people are complaining in January that Wiz wasn't getting a world, pirate players said um, that they were so spoiled. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I don't know why people were so upset that Wiz didn't get a world this year. I thought that was pretty, like, obvious. They even said it like three times last year that they there wouldn't be a world this year. Plus, they said it another two times this year. So I mean, I don't I don't understand why people were so upset and was that they didn't get a world, because it was very obvious that it wasn't going to. Yeah, it was a pretty trash year for updates for them, but I mean, welcome to the world of pirate. <laughs> welcome to the world of pirate. We haven't had a proper update in what like ages, so long, way too long. I don't even remember what year Valencia Part Two came out. Was it 2016 or 15? I think it was 2016 from memory. Um, but yeah. You finished at level 68? Yeah, same. Same. I was kind of gutted that they didn't even make it so that the storyline XP got you to level 70. That's really... That was really the upsetting part for me. Um, really, really upsetting for me. 
Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I don't either. I don't either. The last quality update was um was Marley Bone and Aquila. I mean, there was a couple of updates in between them, like the pit update, which was pretty cool. But um, otherwise, you know. Otherwise, you know. Um, we got the new catacombs and tunnels. Exactly. I I didn't really like Wizards updates this year. It was pretty, you know, eh. But the catacombs were really cool. Um, but I wish there was some more in, in between. Um, the tarot was pretty cool. I haven't even done the Tower of Moo Manchu. So, it is apparently very good. Um, but I haven't even done it. So, <laughs> I literally haven't done it. I have two max characters and haven't done Tower of Moo Manchu. Maybe one day. Yeah. It was, it still is, really. Um... Yeah, Darkmoor's probably more like it um, than Waterworks. Waterworks is pretty easy. Moo Manchu is apparently not as easy. So, yeah. But I haven't even done it yet. I, I still haven't done Moo Manchu. Um, so, yeah, maybe one day I'll actually do that. But I'm still debating whether I want to actually level up my other two... Other two... School set other two classes that I haven't actually done yet, which is Buccaneer and Swashbuckler. Um, I kind of want to, but also kind of don't at the same time, you know? It's a bit of a toss-up at the moment. This is how you felt waiting for uh, six years for a new Animal Crossing game. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, oh, hey look, our chest has respawned again. How much gold are you going to give me this time? 65 that was shit give me something good please next time like 2000 and 400 like before that would be great um dun, 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 dun. valencia part 2 was very rushed it was it was a mess as well um it was just terrible kane is equivalent to every end game boss after a wizard exactly I just, I don't know. It was, Valencia Part 2 doesn't really, it's not very memorable either. Oh, look, a side quest. Would, could you help us fight some centaurs and Amazing. And take back our building materials. Oh, look, we're going to get 24 pages. Staff, we did it, 24 pages of side quests. <laughs> amazing. Uh, amazing. Where is media? I don't even know. I've got way too many side quests. I don't even know. Don't even know. I think it's the six up here. Yeah, I was really disappointed. I'm even more disappointed that we're not going to go to El Dorado. Um, yeah. Right, here we go. Let's do this. Then we have to defeat Medusa. Um... Which is a pretty not terribly difficult thing. Where even are we? Okay, that's fine. Um, What's this? What's this? Did Jason dun, 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 dun. Just use How bat companions and system. turn off My fast combat? No, not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Those companions are so slow, the bat ones. It's so annoying. I hate them. Actually hate them actually hate them um dun, 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 dun. they didn't even place icons on the map and the puppet shows lag tremendously that's one of the ways you could tell yeah i mean the puppet shows weren't even there in test realm i did the whole basically the whole test realm of um valencia um part two when it came out um, and there wasn't even puppet shows in test drama, it was just actual dialogue. Like they used to do, I think there was a couple added in, one in Aquila and then one otherwhere, um, a wee while ago. But before that it was just dialogue, so that's what they did in Valencia Part 2 before they actually added the puppet shows. Which was kind of sad. Um, because there literally was no puppet shows in Valencia Part 2. Up until they added them at the end of test drama. Imagine that, a whole, like... 
book without puppet shows. That would be crazy. That's like a big no-no in Pirate. They didn't, um, yeah. Do, 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 do. I wonder why they completely scrapped the next few books instead of just releasing what they could for now. Um, the Eldorado puppet show is still laggy. I mean, they all are, really. All of the ones in Valencia Part 2. There's, like, two of them, isn't there? I think there's two of them. Um, and they're both... They're subpar. They're very subpar, those two. Um, very, very subpar. Yeah. Yeah, two of them. I thought they were. I knew it wasn't one, and I'm pretty sure it wasn't three because they don't have the budget for that, probably. <laughs> People haven't been spending enough crowns. No, just kidding. It all goes to Wiz and mobile games that don't actually work. Um, but that's fine. That's fine. Vengeance. Strike. Go. Turn the tide. Good job. Where's your block, El Toro? Seriously. Holy moly. Can you just please block for once? You know what? We're going to boost your block just so you definitely block. Okay? You've done this to yourself. They're still making mobile games now. I know. I know. It's crazy. Really, really crazy. Double tap. Kaboom. Burst fire. Kaboom. Haha. -ha. Relentless. Haha. -ha. Relentless. Epic hit. Nice. There we go. Had to roast him one last time. Um, for the year. Yup. Wasn't there one at the Resistance Headquarters 2 talking about how they fled and Avery refused them? Um, I think so. Possibly. Well, we'll find out because I listen to all the puppet shows. Even though I don't listen to dialogue, I still listen to the puppet shows. Because they're cool. Um, but yeah, instead of releasing some of the original Book 15, I wonder why they just scrapped books well book 15 was released um it's just anything past book 15 was not which is kind of sad very sad in fact um but yeah um i i was told that it was due to budgeting um bad management and um something along those lines and that's probably what i would say apparently they had a lot of stuff apparently Apparently they had a huge update ready for Pirate this year um, that they were going to release um, and it got scrapped at the last minute. Like it was a two month like big project that they were working on and it was basically done. Um, and uh oh, she doing something spooky. She got minions. Um, yeah, and they scrapped it right at the last minute just as it was about to go into um, uh, QA. Which is really, really sad. That's actually a big shame. Mainly for all of the people who work so hard on trying to get that update ready. Um, because it's not the devs, the devs' fault. It's literally the um, producers and the higher-ups um, at King's Isle. It's not the devs' fault. They, I know DCS especially. He really wants to get more work done in Pirate. Um, and I'm sure Sam, who is the lead writer of... Um, the lead writer of Wiz now, but was the lead writer of Pirate, um, for the whole, for basically the whole game, um, really wants to get some more done, I can guarantee that. So, yeah, it's quite a shame, really. They must have worked some kind of harsh hours, probably. But then that also explains why Wiz's updates were pretty lacklustre. Um, and, yeah, it's just really bad management is what came down to it in my opinion at least um i heard that kane was originally supposed to have be a level 100 boss in el dorado yeah well i mean the game was meant to end or end at el dorado um at level probably 100 i would say um i don't know for sure but i'm assuming that the max level if the game continued would have been level 100 um but they just um decided no we're not going to do that because, I mean, Sam had this whole story plot plotted out. Like, it was all basically ready to be just written. Um, and designed, uh, like, the bosses and enemies designed and stuff. So it's not like they ran out of ideas. Because they had lots of ideas. The lead writer, Sam, is absolutely fantastic. He's done magnificent stuff to um, Imperia Part 2. 
like absolutely fantastic stuff um but yeah it's just a shame that bad management got in the way and apparently mobile games and was uh, more important than pirate which is really upsetting do, 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 do. crunch time and game development is a big issue apparently so just imagine the time they spend i don't want to <laughs> i don't want to dcs is so good dcs is great um he's a great dev for both both games really he's done a lot of a lot of hard work for both of them because he he's also um reviving crafting a lot in wiz which i respect a lot because i love crafting in wiz it's such an underrated thing um but yeah yeah so he he's done a lot of work a lot of work he's also in charge of pets in both games as well so that's quite cool that's quite cool there's your dodge good job El Toro. good job relentless yes thank you and again no okay of course not of course not you heard the that gazpacho was supposed to be our new avery and then it would be grizzleheim for erica the red smack piece yeah gazpacho was meant to have a house or a area in the um in avery's court apparently that would be like his own wee workshop there and um we would essentially have to make the heart you know how we um he just gives us kane's heart we would have had to make that um going to all of the places while getting all of the map pieces essentially was basically the main plot of the story find gazpacho um make the heart find the rest of the map pieces go to el dorado defeat kane was basically the whole like end game of the story but um that is not how it worked <laughs> that is not how it worked out as we know um but yeah that was essentially apparently how it was meant to go and i would have loved that making the heart with gazpacho and that would be so cool that would have been really fun that would have been absolutely great going to grizzleheim in pirate would have been fantastic um yeah i still think they need to add um at least grizzleheim because it's the one of the things you can pick at the start of the game for like one of the i think it gives i'm pretty sure it gives the health boost which is what i have on this character um where you were born or grow up i should say um and grizzleheim and Crocotopia are the only two that haven't actually been in the game, but are mentioned right at the start of the game. Um, so, yeah. I still think they should add both Crocotopia and Grizzleheim, even if they're side worlds or something. But, you know, that's never going to happen, ever. But that's fine. We've just come to that and accepted it, I guess. Um, I don't think so. I don't actually know that the answer to that question. It wasn't really said anywhere that I read. Um, yeah. Wasn't said specifically that anywhere that I read it, but it could possibly... He could have possibly, but yeah. Stop summoning things. It's not cool. No one likes it at all. Like, literally nobody. Okay, we need to heal El Toro, which is not good. The, these crits are not cool at all. Really not cool. These guys actually do so much damage. Like, so much damage. Um, good vision of Cain called Abel. Yeah, that's actually taken straight from the Bible. Fun fact. Cain was... Um, uh adam's like adam and eve adam's son abel was also one of their sons and then there was another one um i'm not i'm not very religious so i don't know exactly but apparently that's where that was thing yeah the original story was so cool i would have loved that would have absolutely loved it stop no this is not cool i don't like you Mr. Skeletal Hoplite, please die. Wow. 
No. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where's your blood? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh! Oh. God damn it. I hate it when companions die. It's so frustrating. So frustrating. He did 1216, I know. Not cool. Not cool at all. Really not cool. Right. This is time for you all to die. This is die time. Um, Gracie's just gonna hide in the corner for a bit. <laughs> she needs to recover. <laughs> I need to find a, um, I need to find a heal. Real fast. For her. Whew. Well, there's one down. We've got, what, two left? Hopefully. Chain lightning. No, don't chain lightning. Just don't. Just don't. Just don't. Not cool. Right, just Medea left, which is good. Um, no, she's nearly dead. 67, wow. That's good. Where she's dead now. GG. GG. Easy fight. Easy. Obviously. Easy. Definitely did not nearly die at all there. Um, definitely not. We are fine. That was super easy. That's right. So answer me this. My pal Nigel Weathersfield of Ravenwood was a wizard who sought the Gorgon. Now he is a statue. Bring him to me. If I cure him, he'll teach me true magic. I believe he's the um brother or father or something of um Arthur Weathersfield, who's the balance instructor in Ravenwood at the moment. Fun fact. Fun fact of the day. Um This room is a fire hazard, yes. Imagine finding Kane on top of a golden pyramid surrounded by golden robots from the Puppet Show. That would have been so cool. So cool. I would have loved that. Where is this? Is this in Ilios? Of course it is. Of course it is. Let's go to the life fountain. <laughs> Who are we using? Okay, we're using Argos. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Um, right. Where are we? Are we in? Okay, we are in Ikea. I thought we were. Wrong one. Next one. Whoopsie daisy. Whoopsie daisy. You're gonna go and get your pie now, but you'll be back. Okie dokie. I will see you soon. Or in fact, you will see me soon. I think we can finish this off today. I'm pretty sure we can. We've got one, two, three, four quests left. One fight basically which is medusa so that's good um and then it's just basically talk to people essentially um actually wait what's that quest homecoming oh we need to defeat a couple more people actually don't worry i did not quite read properly i'm dumb dun, 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 dun. i have been going for an hour and 28 i sure have been um welcome Miltendo. Um, with that amount of candles, one misstep and your clothes are burnt and the place is destroyed. I mean, luckily it was, um, luckily it was, um, all stones, so that's not too bad. But still, you know, way too many candles. Way too many candles. Too many candles. Dun, 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 dun. Let's head this way. Over to Ilios, which is here. Hopefully, Medusa isn't too bad today. On my Witch Doctor, I think I struggled a bit with, um, with that fight. With the Medusa fight. Um, but we'll see. We will see how it goes. That Raven probably sleeps there. Yeah, probably. And by probably, I mean... 99% sure. In fact, I'm gonna say 100% sure to that one. <laughs> um, so yeah, we'll see what happens. You know, I'm, I'm sure it will be fine. It would only cause minor burns, obviously. 
Only minor berms. Where the heck is Medusa? Why are we going across this way? I don't like this bridge. This bridge is scary. I don't like it. I don't like this area. It's scary. Really don't like this area. Like, I just don't. It's so scary. You get pulled so quickly. So easily. Just everywhere. Everywhere. Well, I don't know where the Medusa is. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't be around here. It looks like ninja pigs came over here. Um, and an eagle of some form. And a snake. And, um... A couple of, um, a manticore, by the looks of it, and a, another eagle. Interesting. Uh, how much do you want to bet she's from Ravenscar? High chance. High chance. We can imagine all we want. They're just hoarding away, um, a completed Darkmoor and Crocotopia in the back files. Probably. Um, do you need help or want help? You can help if you want. I don't really mind. Give me a TFC and I will add you. Um... But yeah, I should be fine. But if you want to help, you can. I never say no to help. Mainly because it speeds up quite a bit as well. So, you know, I would never, never not accept help. I don't think you'd break those. They're bad if you break, I believe, from memory. Could be wrong. But from memory. Um, Argos can just stand there for a bit. Right in front of me. Um, dun, 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 dun. To never see the light of day. Exactly. Um, Sword Roll is the main website. They permit to give sneak peeks to, including pictures of Pirate 101, Crocodile, and Darkmoor. Yeah. Yup. Yup. I mean, it's just how it is. It's how it is, you know. Probably had a completed Polaris too. Imagine that. You gotta get the Horn of Discord. Yeah, probably. The Commodore forgot to call you. Oh, really? Okay, I'll go get that. I'll get that once I've defeated Medusa. I thought it was level 65 I needed something. I don't like it. They, they seem to always forget to call me. I don't know why that is. I don't know if that happens to anybody else. Um, but they... I have literally not heard from my instructor since, like, probably Cool Ranch, I think. He's just like, nah, sorry, sorry, bro, you're on your own. <laughs> sorry, bro, you tried, but nah, you're on your own. I'm pretty sure that's what he was like, literally. I haven't heard a word from him since, like, Cool Ranch. Um, they put Polaris in Wiz, and when that happened, Wiz had a performance issue in that world. That was funny. They still do. There's still a major lag when you ever go to Warsburg. It's quite funny. Quite funny. At least it's not as bad as it used to be. Um, but yeah. Kaboom. Repel borders. Thank you for the block, Argos. Good job. Argos goes in. Jeez. That's crazy. Commodore's probably too busy sleeping in his office, that's true. The game pretty much was like, this is how to click on stuff in Pirate 101. Now we expect you to study the stats and cards on your own, have fun. Yeah, that is true. But, I mean, he, he did call me to him every time in, um, don't you dare kill Bonnie. Please block. God damn it. That's just rude. That's really rude, Mr. Snake. Mr. Snake, I don't like you. Um, uh, let me quickly add you. I forget you can't copy and paste. It's so annoying. So annoying. Um, Virtuous Quentin Holbrook. Welcome to my friends list. Um, right, we'll do that. You can do that and that. Actually, just do that. Um, actually, we're going to go in this real quick. Go invisible. Double damage. We'll go for a nice backstab. Should be good. Kaboom. Argos is actually not terrible. At the moment. This is like the first fight I've ever had with him. Um, that looks like 
A crackle, some mysterious word, exactly. Vengeance strike, please stop. Do I literally have to heal him? God damn it. I hate cheap shots sometimes, so annoying. That and repel borders always screws me over. Millie, why did you not kill? I am disappointed in you. Very disappoint. Um, right, you're not dying. You're not dying on my watch. You're not dying on my watch. Mr. Argos, I cannot afford for you to die. Bonnie Ann was unfortunate, but you definitely cannot die. You are way too... doing too much damage. Repel borders. Good job. These crits are not cool. These crits are really not cool. Don't like them. Ryan reminds me to log in and make sure you have god tier pets in training. Yeah. You should. You should definitely do that. You probably won't be able to join because we're so far through the battle. And that's somehow how it goes. I don't know why it does that. You should be able to join. I would say, but you can't. It's so annoying. Really, really annoying. Um, right, let's just go for one of these. Actually, it can't kill both. That's so upsetting. This is so sad. Actually, you can do... Actually, no, you can do this because Gracie is worse. And you can do 642. I believe in you. Argos, this is all you, buddy. All you. Um, the Commodore is so adorable. Constantly forgetting about what he talks about. Argos, you had one job. Jeez. Um, yeah. He's great. He's great. He is great. A necessity since the drop rates for boss items are complete garbage too. Yup. Yup, yup, yup. Um. Second chance chest reward would be great. But, you know, that would destroy their profit margins, you know? There's something up high on a ledge. I feel the draft from a tunnel. Let's go that way. Right, let's get Medusa. Oh, we meant to be blindfolded. Damn it, I'm not blindfolded. That's a shame. Medusa, she's cam. We don't need eyes to see you, monster. Attack! Um, what is she? Swashbuckler, that's right. She's freaking ridiculous actually ridiculous i remember i remember now oh buccaneer nice um right we're gonna do that you can do this i guess sure you can come down here dun, 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 dun. i could have sworn she was a privateer nah she's a swashbuckler she is a swashbuckler. Last time I faced her, she was also a swashbuckler. And that was um, ages ago. So, yeah. I believe she's always been a swashbuckler. But, I mean, a privateer would make sense as well, I would say. Um, but, you know. It's just how it goes. Just how it goes. Medusa drops her weapons. Could be worth stitching. Um, maybe. Maybe, if they drop. If they drop. They probably won't, knowing my luck. Um, but you never know. You never know. You're insane. Fair enough. Isn't everybody, though? Privateer for the summon doubloon only. Summon doubloon Medusa can use battle seal at a low chance. Noise. Um. Okay, that was rude. Stop hitting Argos. He doesn't like it. He will stun you. Ripos. Haha. -ha. These guys are all bunched up, aren't they? Very, very much so. Very, very bunched up. Um, we'll do that. Gracie can do that. Actually, she can't do that now. We'll do that. You can do that. Sounds good. Done. 
Medusa is myth and whiz. That is very correct. Very, very correct. Blocked. Oh no. Luckily, she doesn't have repost. I'm actually quite surprised about that. As a swashbuckler, not having repost, that's kind of crazy. Um, sad part about Buccaneer is that outside of Peter, you don't have any have any more offensive Buccaneers unless you purchase them with crowns. Yeah, yeah. Peter's great though. Peter is very good. Um, in pirate, you love seeing. Um, in pirate, you love seeing mobs move and not confined to a battle circle. That's also true. That is a very good part of pirate. Um. Up upper tier offensive buccaneers like Granado and Timjin, yeah. And even Bar. Hmm. 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 Buccaneers don't need companions for your reckless frenzy. I haven't actually really played a buccaneer, so I have absolutely I don't really have too much of a opinion on that, but sounds bad. Sounds bad. Buccaneer is literally the class I have played the least. Like, actually the least. Um, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 Well, there we go. It's dead. Good job, Barnabas. Good job, Barney. Right. Gracie, go. Too bad your opponent's dead, but that's fine. Immobilize, nice. Gotta love that immobilization. God love it. Um, Reckless stacked with Vela's fortress first. Amazing. VA on top of the Vela's fortress, yeah. VA and VF are very, very good together. Very, very good. Very, very, very useful. Um, Here we go. um, right, you can do that. Do you have Bladestorm? No, you don't, but that's fine. That's fine. Um, yeah. Actually, just crit on him. Just crit on him, because might as well. Because, why not? Because, why not? Vengeance, strike. Badoom. Bladestorm. Relentless. But wait, he keeps going. And he hasn't even attacked yet. Good job. GG. Nice. Nice. I have fast combat on. I do have fast combat on. I literally have fast combat on. I will show you. I will show you. Um, fast combat on. I do have fast combat on. Don't worry. I'm not dumb. I'm not dumb. <laughs> I do actually have fast combat on. It does feel slow, but that's just Argos and um, especially Gracie. Gracie feels very slow sometimes. Um, but I do have fast combat on. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. I'm not that dumb. May seem it, but I'm not. Right here we go. GG. You got Obsidian Key. Nice. I don't even know what I got. What did I get? Um, not much. Mark of Marleybone. Um, right now we need to go to Medea this way. It's not like kings are using slow combat. Yeah. I mean, even fast combat does feel quite slow, like a lot of the time. So, yeah. Nice. We get a free teleport over there. Isn't that handy? So nice of her. So considerate. So considerate. Um. Dun, 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 dun. Um. The arms of Apollo. A neat drop. I didn't even. What is that? I'm assuming it's probably a weapon. Nope. Uh -huh. 
I really don't know much of pirates. I've played for so long, but I just actually don't have much. What is it? Is it like... Oh, arms are all of that. Oh. Yeah, that's not too bad. Not too bad. You're gonna go farm Sato? Okie dokie. Have fun. I don't know much gear in pirate, okay? I literally have no clue. Captain, come fight beside me again. Help me regain my throne. And I am reunited with 